Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. Always the Sonia Show. On today's show, we'll take a look at our nation's booming oil industry. With the help of our Minister of Oil, we recorded the following. Just a moment. I have some very important news to share. <gasps> You're kidding me. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go live to our reporter at the wall. The wall. Is it Jon Snow? Beatrice, can you hear me? Yes, Sonia. I'm here at the wall where an attack has just happened. With me is Darren, who witnessed the event. I'm on? Yeah. So I was sleeping in my tent when I heard a bang. Like a big explosion, you know. When I got out, I saw a huge fire at the wall. Do you know what caused the explosion? I, I think a truck smashed into it. That's right, Sonia. Oh, yeah, I remember now. The truck crashed into the wall, killing a teenager on the spot. Nah, you got it wrong. The truck didn't kill the teen. Border forces did. They're shooting kids all the time. Hey, don't grab my mic. Uh-oh. Oof. Looks like we're having some technical difficulties. Wish I could say I'm surprised the brigades are behind this, but I can't. Thank you for your report, Beatrice. Have no fear. The authorities will ensure nothing like this occurs on election day. Remember, I'll be there live. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate. Let's polls. see how if we need to push. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. As we approach election day, more and more protests are occurring in our fine country. Don't support the violence. Vote for Tyrak. As you know, unbiased so journalism right here. Concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing team report. Okay, let's see. Remember, if you have any uh, information, please call the Sonia hotline. Uh, this one is really far away from the border. Um. But it's always better to have more Take money. A good hard look. Uh. Hmm. Let's go with this one, even though it's further away. It should be should be better. 1944 miles to the border. Quite fast. Quite fast. Quite far. So we'll see if we can make it. At least we got some money in case we run out of energy or something, or we can call ourselves a cab. No, I haven't... I haven't been here before. Why keep the neons open up, though, in the... in... daylight? It just looks weird. Okay. By the way, this game uh, so far has been phenomenal in my opinion. I mean, as far as uh, procedurally generated games go, this really does what promises. Procedurally generated stories. I'll just vandalize some shit first because, you know, I want people to not vote for this dude. Because you just gotta look at its, his face and see that he's, you know, fucking douchebag. The Sonya show. I don't really like Sonya. I mean, that's that doesn't look good. <laughs> um. Those do not look reliable at all. Okay, so I can rest here and I will after I'm done exploring this place. Vandalize this, this, and this. I won't vandalize that. And I'll sleep now because I want to have full energy. Because I might not get a chance afterwards to do that. So. A nap is always welcomed. I kind of hope for two, two bars of energy, but it is what it is. 
and you can walk better at night because you know, it's not as hot. Somebody lock me in here? The fuck? Oh. Good thing I picked up the uh, pick a lock skill before. Anyway, let's um, let's look around a bit more with more energy. Yeah, I do have information about the brigades, but I won't. I won't squeal. Snitches and get stitches. Uh, not gonna eat raw food, but I will look for money. Twenty-four percent chance it's good. Ne never mind. Thank God you're here, kid. Uh, okay, relax, go slow, please. You saw that beautiful limo out there, right? That's Sonya's. I'll play dumb. Uh, Patria's best reporter and number one celebrity. Hello? You gotta deliver that champagne up to her. Why me? I do it myself, but it doesn't seem... Uh, classy. And I fired room service last week. They were doing inappropriate things to the food. Of course you will. Oh, now grab the bottle and get going. Uh, Sonya doesn't like to wait. Show, go! I mean, I will, but just hold on a second. First of all. Second of all, how is it more appropriate for a dusty 15-year-old kid to bring the champagne? Jesus Christ. My tape. I'll buy it. I'll fucking steal it. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. The elevator's at the end of the hallway. She's in room 307. Oh. Um, what's that? What did they win? Oh, I won five bucks. That's nice. Uh, if I do this, take that, fucking steal that. Uh, oh, no, wait, something here still. Let's go, let's do it, as the song says, which will be most likely copyrighted. Uh, okay, go up. 307, they said, right? And I have some car, car keys, so I can get the fuck out of here if I have to. Poor dude. I don't wanna go in there. Just pretend. My god, some people are fucking disgusting. Jesus, look at that. Jesus Christ, finally! Put it on the table and get the hell out! My goddamn pleasure. Wait, you ever take photos? Yeah? With my phone? the camera and I'll explain. Chop chop. No. No. Chop chop. I mean, I didn't mean like that. Jesus Christ. You're the fucking perv. Ah. Oh. Okay, here's the scoop. I've sent Adam, my driver, to meet two members of the Black Brigades in the warehouse across the street. While he talks, I want you to take photos. Got it? Why? 
the terrorist group responsible for the attack in 86. Am I the only educated person in Petria? Might as well be after the, after all the propaganda you're putting out. Psst, down here, you see me? Of course we see you. No. What do I do if they start asking questions? You keep that trap shut. The kid and I'll tell you what to say through the earpiece. Oh god. Now we wait. Kid, you got any questions? Any at all? Now's the time to ask. Uh. Yeah, how about the kid who died? Because that was yeah. me. I know the brigades are behind it somehow. Please! He's got a stranglehold on this country. Mm, yep, he kind of does. Can I pee, Sonia? It burns. For the hundredth time, no! I will. I won't say anything. Can I? Can I not say anything? I don't. I don't want to fucking help her. She's not a nice person. Uh, but she sees it as well. Hopefully. Uh, God damn it. Okay. I'm going in. Hey there, guys. Hey there, guys. Jesus Christ! Evening, Thelonious. I know. Sweetie Pie, take a photo. No, I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Is this because I slept in the alley? Would this have happened if I didn't? Oh fuck. Let's talk inside. This better be good, Thelonious. The important guy's Robert, head honcho of the brigades, who's never been photographed. Adam! We can't see you! You gotta make them move! Guys, uh, can we go somewhere else? The Feng Shui is off here, right? You're a very strange man. I got a bad feeling about this, R. Relax. We're looking for info on where Tyrax is gonna be. Thelonious is gonna help us. With that kid Alex's help, maybe we can take him out. Sir Thelonious, what can you tell us about Tyrax? Okay, honey buns, think fast. Numbnuts needs our help. Uh. So, Thelonious. Nothing. I told you he was a waste of time. Kid, you gotta tell him something to say. Uh, ask him for money. Money first, then I talk. This guy is shady, R. Money, or I walk. Understand? Whoa, whoa. Let's stay cool. Oh, Adam's a trooper. He'll be fine. You're not going anywhere. Tim, search him. We got an earpiece, R. We need to go. No, we go on the roof. It's time for a more serious discussion. Fuck, I didn't want to help her. I don't want to get the driver shot or killed. Just keep taking photos. I won't take any fucking photos. I don't agree to murder. Whoever's listening, I sure hope your friend knows how to fly. Don't. Don't kill him, please. Zero. I don't have the camera. Alonius goes over. Got it? You 
Don't you dare give him the camera, honey buns. That's my story. Five. Shit, I wanna save the dude's life. Good choice, kid. Grab the camera, Tim. We're getting out of here. What did you do? I'm not gonna get the fucking guy killed, you crazy motherfucker. He would have wanted you to keep the camera. Nope, you forced me into this, you Can't mean you person. I was gonna make you a junior producer. You can get your junior producer and stick it up your goddamn ass. Hi, Adam. Hope you're happy with yourself for ruining the story. Sorry, Sonya. Get out of here, sugar. For I tell the cops there's a missing teen in my room. Whew. Well, that was close. Let's see if we can get into these rooms. Uh, so, somebody who smokes. Is, is it a taxi driver? Um... Nothing. I want to stay to listen to on all the fucking doors. That's inappropriate. Let's go steal a car and just go. What took you so long? I lost track of time, boy. Uh, well, anyway. Here's a few bucks for your help. Oh, few? That's fucking 15. Hope she talks about the blue water on her next show. I love sewing you so much. My god, you fucking people. Room's open now. Let's go see what's going on here. Why they win? Oh, for fuck's sake. That's a lot of dollars. The fuck is this room? There's nothing here. That's disappointing. Let's go get the car and go away. I'm sorry about the person. I'm sorry about the person, uh, which car I'm about to steal with. Uh, I really, really wanna... I just gotta go away. Gotta get, get to the border and get past the border. And lose as... Less energy... As possible. And also keep the money. I know I have a lot of money stashed at the border. But, you know. I didn't get that far. The wild boys. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get in, Mitch. With pleasure. These motherfuckers again. Don't look at us. Just do what we say, and you won't get hurt. Why do you dress like that? That's like that's fucking ridiculous. Shut up and step on the gas. Fine, so the cops can fucking get me and I'll God damn it. Our motor not starting outside the laundromat after we rob it. Humiliating. Uh you think I don't know that, Stan? It's your fault, you know. My fault? Oh, that's rich, Mitch. Uh, so where am I supposed to go again? You know what, Mitch? Maybe you should find another Robin partner. Well, uh, maybe I should. Like this kid. Uh, nope. That's fine. Fine. Take the kid. He's clearly a criminal anyway. Well, I'm fucking not. Hold on, hold on. Before we end the best Robin duo ever, let's take a deep breath. Yeah, we shouldn't rush into this. This is big.
taking deep breaths okay let's put the radio on it'll help us forget about the laundromat good idea a laundromat robbery happened about oh, an hour ago fuck. ah jeez witnesses say the two robbers both dressed like they were into s and m role playing argued the entire time though the suspects only made off with 72 dollars in quarters they are said to be armed and very dangerous if you see them Please call the police immediately. We're laughing stocks. And Sonya reporting it no less. Oh jeez. Sorry. But I think you're you're, you're great together. I mean, seventy two dollars. That's like uh, it ain't much, but it's honest work. Well, I guess that's it. Stan and Mitch are breaking up. Go on and partner up. I don't want to. Yeah, I guess that's it. Wow. You should risk seriously reconsider. Only one thing left to do. To be sure this is the right move, and I'll give the kid Mitch's ultimate bank robin quiz. Yeah. I don't want to be a robber. Are you fucking deaf? Both of you. You need to start thinking about your future, kid. Here's how it works. Get enough questions, right? You and Mitch become robin partners. But don't? Then Mitch and I have to... Uh, I don't want to spell it out. Go on, say it. I dare you. Question what is going on? Number one of the following, what is the best location to rob? The clock is a uh, ticking. Uh, a laundromat, you motherfuckers. Though you can never have too many quarters, this is wrong. Because sometimes your moto breaks down in front of them. Well, That's strike one. will they fucking kill me if I don't answer right? Question number two. When is the best time to rob? After it's dark. Hopefully that's correct. Strong. That's when the Sonya show is on. Strike two. This is your last chance. <laughs> Question three. What is the best getaway vehicle? A motorcycle. Like you had it. You would think. But no. Yeah. Sometimes they break down in front of life. Oh well. I ain't gonna play your fucking game, you dumbasses. Kid. Fuck off. I made enough progress and I think I'm left with enough energy, I believe. Like one. Oh, three. Okay. Do I still have my money though? Because if I do, I can just, you know, grab something to it. I do not. I guess I'm fucked. Can you hear me? What's that noise? It's a bug messing with the connection. But don't worry. Oh, it's, I thought it was. It, I thought this was empty. Okay, never mind. There. That work? Help me a sec, homie. I got a bug I need to fix. Uh, psh, psh, sure. No problem. Help me in return, maybe. Yo, we live in a quid pro quo society. What happened to altruism for the sake of altruism? But yeah, fine. I'll give you a little something something. Who are you talking to? Don't sweat it, Mr. Yu. It's just a hitchhiker. What do I do? Take this computer. I put a metal detector on it. Check the ground near the pole over there. Should be some hidden keys to open the box and reboot the line. 
Petra Calm hides their keys like a dog hides a bone. The key should be somewhere near the pole. Um, okay. There we go. There we go. Oh, found three dollars. Never mind. We're doing what we can, Mr. Yu. There we go. Nice find, dog. Well. Beeping guide you. Oh, nice. That's better than money and food. It shouldn't be long now. Just give me a bit. Nah. Oh, something happened there. You find it yet? I did just leave me alone. I want to find a bit more money. Let the beeping guide you. No. How about here? Near this. Kid, I swear to God, I'll just drop this. I don't need your fucking help. Come on. Come on. Nice. Okay. Now open the box to reboot the line. Pretty dope metal detector. Thanks, dog. You hear me now? I do. Yeah. So, as I was gonna say, the fake emitters are all in place. Should keep those pigs busy for a while. Thanks, Alex. You're looking for the brigades, boy? Ding. You win a chicken dinner, homie. I gotta run, Alex. Wait, wait, my parents. Sorry, kid. Now's not the time. We'll talk soon, okay? Promise. Don't hang up. Home slice. Press the button again. Hello? Too late. He's gone. about my reward anything you okay I'm mm. just a little frustrated why i'm looking for info on my bio parents and they died when i was young in the attack in 86 but i haven't come up with much i am very sorry they died but Keep going, don't give up. Thanks. My mom, I mean my adoptive mom, said I might not find out anything, but I didn't believe her. If she's at home, or on the road doing her job. Come on, let's wait out the rain in the booth. Come on, don't be... Chicken. This is not very comfortable. But maybe call your mom. You'll feel better. I, I don't know. I'll tell her you're okay at least. Yeah, well, I guess you're right. Precinct 22, Officer Fanny. Hello? Alex? Is that you? Yeah. 
It's me. Is everything okay? What do I say? Start talking. Everything's fine. I just wanted to check in. Are you getting enough to eat? You are, right? And you can come back whenever you want. You know that. Say you're eating enough, boy. Yeah, I'm getting enough to eat. Thanks. I... I hope you find what you're looking for. I miss you, Alex. Tell her you miss her too. Come on. I... Come on. Be nice. I miss you too. Look. I should go. Oh. Already? Say you'll call again. I'll call again soon. I promise. I love you. Bye. Hey, 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 Bye. hey, hey. You could have said it back, but Come okay, on. it's fine. It's cramped in here. I feel better now. Thanks for encouraging me to call. Glad I could help. Uh, did you hear about the kid that died crossing? I'll Yo, keep pushing it. I got eyes and ears and an IQ of 180, dog. What happened is awful. You really think the brigades did this? No, the fastest pigs did this. I think we should fl Yeah, homegirl knows what's up, I think. At least on certain issues. I still have a few things to clean up around here. By the way, there's a cereal bar in my bag if you want. You look hungry. Oh, and I can call you a taxi too. I hacked into Happy Taxi, because I can, and got some free ride vouchers. Um. Oh, thank God. A uh, taxi would be awesome. It's as good as done. And good luck on your journey, man. Hope you reach 96. Appreciate it. What a nice fella. I know I got in with the creepy dude, but I don't care. As long as I'm in the car, and I'm fed, and I got three bucks, so... Not mean to brag, but that's like a thousand bucks already. Ugh. I would have hoped it would take me further, but that's fine. Oh, please. That would be nice. I don't need to talk. We can stay here in... We can stay here in silence. Yeah, no, okay, this is awkward. Well, this is more awkward. I don't want to. Can I just wait and see what happens? I'll just wait for a bit. See what happens. Well, I will. I'll wait for a minute or something. Nothing will happen, most likely. Some people really do miss the point. Yeah, okay, so I waited, nothing happened. Sorry. 
sorry. Forgot you were back there. <laughs> Did you now? So where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? To the border, please. Oh. What? Sorry. What I mean is, of course, the customer is always king. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Very happy. Let's get our energy back and do some progress. Why are you watching me sleep? All that belonged to the last customer. I'm sorry for the mess. He left that behind too. Oh fuck, here it comes. That's you! Sorry about that. Me too. This person forgot a lot of things. By the way, everything I'm telling you is the truth. We're called Happy Taxi, but we could be called Honest Taxi, too. Believe you, man. Don't sweat. If you have some questions about the road, I can help you with those. Um... What are you doing on election day? Because I'm not going to push with the kid anymore. I'll be there. It's a very important day. You... Yeah, I'll cheer for the Flores candidate. I won't. Nah, fuck. Jared's cold anger. Um, what's on the radio? You shouldn't be this close to me. Now sit back and stay seated. Enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Can I go back? I need to get I need to get the border. I need to get to the border, I need to escape. Ah, fuck me. Sorry, I didn't. I'm going to turn the music up now. Do you like dinosaurs? Oh. Uh. <laughs> I don't think so. Did you say something? It was my stomach. Oh, I see. You know what? Uh, I'm good. We haven't reached your destination. Customer is always king. I think I have a flat tire. Better take a look. Sit tight, okay? What the fuck are you? I'm getting the fuck out of here. Oh, look at that. Impressive. I think I'm close enough. We did good. 
Thank you, buddy. I was uh, I was a bit too much. Ain't taking three taxi rides anytime soon. Oh look, it's uh, the little boy's mom, the cop. Spoiler alert. But if you didn't know that, you should go back and watch the other episodes. I would. Not I would appreciate it, but uh, um, it'll help you understand better what's going on here. So, you know. That's pretty far away. Uh, can I vandalize some shit around here? No. That was very far away for no good reason whatsoever. <laughs> no good, flipping tire. Mm, can I help you, ma'am? I'm very tall for a 15-year-old. Just some car trouble, kid. What are you doing out here? Uh, I can help with car trouble. Are you changing the subject on me? Well. If you got any advice, I guess it wouldn't hurt to hear it. Um, I'm kind of a tire expert oh, yeah? myself. Have at it, kid. Um, take off tire. What are you? A tire whisperer? Damn right I am. Let's see. Hey, don't stop there. The pump's behind you. That's precisely how mounting a new a new wheel looks like. You know, you remind me of my son. He's always fixing things. Always breaking things too. Here. Stopper? What's... oh. There we go. Thanks a lot, kid. Gotta say, I'm impressed. What now, though? Uh, just my luck. What? Come on, follow me. What? What now? Are you gonna arrest me? Or something? Oh shit. Okay, so, um. Yes. How about the thing that died? Since it's you're in the force. What that's what I think. Oh, that's easy. Wouldn't have happened under Flores. Oh. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. I'm not spreading propaganda. I don't know who your favorite candidate is, don't I? What's wrong? You could say that, yeah. You could definitely say that. Do you want to talk about With it? You? That's all right. No offense. Could help you, you know. Yeah. Maybe you're right. It's just that my son, my adopted son, ran away. Can I ask why? So we go into the whole thing, maybe we can tell her. I... 
I knew something that he didn't, a secret. And when I told him, he got upset. I told him who his biological parents were, or as much as I know about them anyway. And who were they? Dangerous people, kid. Very dangerous. Dangerous? They were members of the Black Brigade. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Me too. How did you get uh, to adopt him? You know about the attack in 86, right? Yeah. That's the day I met my son. You were there? Yeah. I was working security. Hired to protect Tyrak at the wall's opening ceremony. Go on. Everything was going fine until... It wasn't. I barely saw the truck before it crashed into the mountain. Just a flash. Next thing I knew, rocks were falling on the crowd. It was... awful. So I'm sorry to hear that. You have no idea. The screams. Everything was just so... terrible. At some point, I... I looked down and... There was my son. Silent. Covered in dust. Looking up at me. Maybe I shouldn't have. But I... I picked him up and brought him home with me. I just had to make sure he was going to be safe. I had to. Go on. I looked in the papers for months after. Searched the missing children reports every day. There was nothing. It's not unusual for brigades to cut ties with family. What? So you think his parents are dead? I do. What other explanation is there? I... I guess I deserve all this. I kept the truth from my baby. Well, you did. You were trying to protect him and give him like a life outside all this mess, so... Thanks, Peach Fuzz. I appreciate you saying The intentions that. were good. Central to Unit 2, do you copy? Over. I should get that. Look, kid. I don't know what you're up to out here. Just promise me something. And what that? Turn around and go home. Okay? Your parents miss you. Can I get a ride someplace else? You left me here, didn't you? That's nice. And I don't have enough money for a bus, so... Um... Let's hitchhike this time. I really need to catch a ride. Because I need I also need to have like enough energy for when I get to to the borders. You listen to me. What you did is unforgivable. Listen to me now. Leave Alex alone. He's a kid. Don't tell me to calm down! You don't want to go down this road! Listen to me now! Leave Alex alone! Go away, young blood! No, you listen to me! What you did is unforgivable! Are you for real? 
Don't tell me to calm down! He's 14 years old! The more and more uh, signs are uh, already vandalized, so... I guess something is working. Are you really that stupid? Are you for real? Are you for real? Don't tell me to calm down! Go in the back and steal something and then go on the front. The Toxic Avenger, nice. Nice. That was a lot of money, what can I say? Now that's bucks. That's mean. <laughs> Why threaten the dog always? Just leave the fucking dogs out of it. And now I'll be a nice person and just what do you want kid if you want food sorry only truckers can eat here what i can't eat uh, the guy on the phone That's big john i heard things about him Shady things. Actually, yeah. Backup security for Tyrak to ensure his victory. You know what I mean? Now get out of here before I call the cops. Asshole. Listen to me now. Leave Alex alone. All about you. He's a kid. You, can you give me any money? He's 14 years Sorry. old. Saving up for an infinity pool. I could care less that you all voted on this. You motherfucker. Saving up for an I infinity God, pool. I'm a 15 year old kid and I ask you for a bit of money. You tell me, tell me you're saving up for an infinity pool. You fucking piece of shit. Listen to me now. Leave Alex alone. Of course he said yes. He thinks this is all a game. Hey, listen. Okay. Listen to me, Robert. You asked a kid to make you a bomb. Are you stupid? If anything happens to him, I'm coming for you. Got me? He's a uh, big John. The kid's kid. biological Please. father. No, no. Listen, please. You don't want to do that. I know what I promised you. But you can't do that. Please, listen. Hello? Hello? Oh, God damn it! What are you looking at? Good. Did you maybe calm down a little bit? Young blood, come over here. Sit down. I am. I'm sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just I was angry at myself. Anyway, I feel better now that I've eaten a little something. I'm glad you're feeling better. Well, when I get emotional, I eat. What can I say? I did. Makes me sick, them saying the brigades did it. What about you? What do you think? <sighs> I wish I could 100% agree, but I've seen many politicians come and go. Hey, I got all this food. Eat something. Oh yes, please. Hey, feeling better? Still look like you've run a marathon in the desert. I did. I got an idea. 
Why don't you catch up on some Z's in my rig? I, d I could use some sleep. Yeah. Nice. I do wish one day to have like a tour of the United States. Just stop at one of these truck stops and eat some, you know, greasy and healthy food. Just sort of just that sort of experience. I just think it's cool. And hey, the it's time to wake up, young boy. country itself. Sorry to wake you like this. Uh, how'd you sleep? I'm full I'm full of energy and money, so I'm good. I am flushed. Glad to hear it. That's Robert. He's the guy I was angry with on the phone. And it's funny. I once considered him a friend. Well, I met him and he's a piece of shit as well. That's the kid I was talking to. He's crazy smart, young blood. I think I know him. Glasses and a tiny computer? Yep. Small world we live in. He thinks I broke a promise. And I did. But I have my reasons. What well, was the promise? I promised to tell him about his biological parents. I knew them. They were in the brigades, like me. Listen, I hate to ask this, but I need your help. Sure. Thanks, kid. The kid won't listen to me. But maybe he'd listen if you gave him a call on the CB. I can try. I, I don't know. But be honest, and don't speak down to him. We gotta get him to step away from Robert and the bomb. A lot of people could get hurt if we don't. I can try. Thank you, young blood. But the CB is in front of That's you. a lot of fucking pressure, though. I told you, John, I don't want to talk. This isn't John. Who is this? Uh, I helped you fix a payphone. I remember. Yeah, that was cool, homie. I see John's ID on the CB. He there? Yeah, he is. Man, I knew it. So, how's it going? Homie, I don't want to be rude. But why are we talking? Well, uh, John is a good guy and cares about you, okay? I see. He told you what I was doing for Robert then? Look, I don't see where this discussion is going. I'm about to hang up. Please, don't lose him, young blood. Why? Well, even if he is, I'm using him too, to get info on my parents. And sometimes, people need to be hurt for a cause. You know what Tyrax doing to teens, homie. I know, but... We can't go, we can't keep killing each other like that. Like sometimes you have to, sometimes you have to get your hands dirty and sometimes people die when change has to be made or is made or is going to be made. But that's not the case, you're a kid and you have no job to making bombs. If he cared, why would he break his promise? He said he was gonna tell me about my parents, but he never has. Look, I don't got much time. I promise Robert results. Don't do it, kid. You don't want blood on your hands. Believe me, I know. I just want info on my parents. No one will tell me anything. John, tell him about his goddamn parents already. I, I don't know where to start. Start with their names. Naomi. 
and Steven. Those were your parents' names. Naomi and Steven? Splutter can keep going. What you did? That hurt me, John. We had a deal. I trusted you. I know. I'm sorry, kid. Please forgive me. I want to know more. But not from you. I'll ask Robert. Please, Alex! No! Damn it, damn it, damn it! Ah. Fuck. Mm. You did what you could, young blood. It's all my fault. Ah, shit. I'll steal the car again. Fuck it. I got places to be. And I ain't got, I ain't got time to follow the law. To the letter. So. Why no going down? Okay. If there are, if I hope I don't get to meet those two fucking assholes again, I swear to God. Fuck is that? Your car insurance has been revoked with failure to pay. Yeah, sure. Well, I want to... Uh, I want to drive to a location, please. I want to go as fast and as far as possible, like that. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Nice, we're nine, nine miles to the border. No, we actually made it to road 96. Nice. Then kick it again. Nice. Did you know that Vigo broke his toe when he kicked the helmet in Lord of the Rings? Holy fuck, now they have helicopters? Jesus Christ! I did not expect that. I do not remember that happening. Let's just fucking go. Uh, well, no, we, we have a bit of time. I imagine the next uh, next try will be even harder. Ah, oh, fuck, the tree broke. Shit. Um, vote please. Nice. It's it's nice that you know they keep adding, you keep adding on to them. Uh, so and every time you come back here, if you make it, you find what you what the other kid before you did. So you know. Let me see if I can. Go there and go to the 
spawn too and maybe there's something to to eat or uh, this fella as well shit well, I guess we can rest in the cave for a bit I'll put another stone. Add a stone. Nice. It's a person who left some money here. I heard rumors about this rock, but didn't think it actually exists. Anyway, I don't know who you are or if you're a crystal like me, but thanks, I really mean it. Because of you, I now have a chance to leave this hell for once and for all. You're welcome. I have money stashed in two places. Uh, but I... I won't leave money now for you, unfortunately, because I need it. But maybe next time. Right. Wait, are there still money? Uh, no. No, I don't want to leave money. I thought there were still some money there, but... There aren't. Hopefully this time we won't, um... We won't die. And hopefully those nice people are still here. I can still buy a snack or two from them so I can fill my energy up. There we go. Seems we've come from south and east more than the west side of the country. That's fucking Sonia, fucking piece of human garbage. I and I can't fuck. In just a few days, the nation will honor the victims of 86 and elect its new president. When historians look back on this September 9th, many will consider it the most important day ever in the history of Petria. It's perfect. The entire country will be watching. I agree. The time to act is now. Intelligence says the brigades will try something, Mr. President. If they do, I'll crush them once and for all. Of course, I'll be here all day, reporting live at the scene. This has been Sonia Sanchez for GNN. And cut! Kid. Where are the people that used to be here? Uh, can I get through? I have to wait until they're done with this story. Now move along, or I'll move you myself. Oh, are you crying, Sonia? A girl died here in '86. Lola was her name. I, I, I tried. I tried to save her. But, but the rocks, they, they kept coming. It's just, sometimes, I wish I had died. And she lived. Oh, Sonia. Saw my brothers recently. 
It'd been ages. I haven't been so kind to the ones I love lately. Figures. That leaves just the brigades. Time to cut the head off the snake. Can I go through now? Oh, thank God. Oh, yeah, a drink, please. Is this your stand? That's an election. But I think it's gonna be big. Just hope the good guys come out on top. But I know history isn't necessarily on our side. Kid, you've got to be smarter than that. Security is all over the place. They'll send you to you know where. And my wife and I will end up in prison. Can we trust you? Okay. You could try to convince a guard to let you enlist. You seem smart. Just follow the line of trucks to the gate. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. Special 10 year commemoration of the collapse. There's some never before seen footage there. My husband and I were asleep when it happened. Well, we were until the explosion. But we don't believe the kid died the way they say. I'll give you a tip. I'll just, just don't mind me. Don't mind me. Just vandalize this real quick. I can't. Here for the offshore worker exam. I am. Are you registered? Everything looks in order. You can head inside. Nice. Let's see. Do I get a quiz or something? Oh, if it's a quiz, I would rather run from the fucking guards than have a quiz then. Welcome. You're here for the offshore worker test. If you fail, it's because you have lied and you will be detained. It's too late to leave. Try and you will also be detained. The test will be difficult. Only the most honest citizens will pass. Your number will be displayed behind me. When it appears, it's your turn. Your test results will also be displayed there. So pay attention. There are certain requirements you need to know. Only married persons with at least one child can rightfully apply. Your contract, if you pass, will last for five years. No more, no less. Lastly, the majority of your pay will be sent back to your homeland. Your number will soon be displayed. Bless our beautiful nation. What number do I have? Candy 13. What are you doing? Your number's on the screen! Get in there! I'm sorry, Jesus Christ. Oh fuck. Uh sure, let's let's get it over with. Quiet. Let us begin. Question one. What is your candidate number? 13. Question 2. How old is your eldest child? He's 5. Strange. You look very young. Question 3. If you pass, how long will your stay abroad be? 5 years. Question 4. What age would your eldest child be when you return from abroad? 10. Question 5. Are you, or have you ever been, a black brigade? No. Question six. Have you ever listened to illegal radio stations? Be honest. No. Question seven. When did the Black Brigade 86? attack occur? Oh, fuck. Question nine. Who is our great president? Question 11. Which of the following do you enjoy the most? Thank you. 
you have answered all the questions. Petria is a democratic country, so you have the opportunity to ask at this time a question of your own. I have nothing to ask them. It's good not to ask questions. You can now wait for your test results in the waiting room. Tinta. Hopefully you'll not be arrested. Good day. I think I did good. You look young to take this test. Shut up. I'm older than I look. Don't worry, I won't say anything. Six, shut the fuck up. Fuck yes, best. 14 failed. Who's 14? Number 13, you have passed. Stand up and leave. And may you well represent our blessed nation. <sighs> yeah, sure, I'll come back. Freedom. Nothing is more important. But there are many others in Petria still looking for it. Nice. We don't have that much until election, so... Oh god! That's not good. journeys have only just begun.